In our health cast today, there could be a new way to catch stomach cancer before it actually develops in in-risk patients. Dr. Omar Laguna, who's a surgical oncologist with Memorial Healthcare, says that researchers have identified a gene variation in patients who have the H. pylori bacteria. H. pylori does grow in the membrane that lines your stomach and it increases the risk of certain types of stomach cancer. When patients undergo endoscopy for gastritis, for reflux, it's very common that they'll undergo a biopsy to see whether or not they're H. pylori positive. And what the study is showing is that there's a subset of patients that actually have a specific immune response to that infection that they can identify which one of those have such a strong response that they're actually at higher risk for gastric cancer. So what does that mean? We can possibly self-select patients who um, would benefit from increased screenings given the identified higher risk for gastric cancer. And rates are actually pretty low here in the U.S., but the doctor says worldwide gastric cancer is the second leading cause of death. And a recent study by the American Academy of Pediatrics found a link between COVID infe infection and severe croup. Croup is a common illness in babies and young children. It leads to trouble breathing and that really uh, bark-like cough, raspy, hoarse voice that we know. Researchers monitored 75 young patients who had croup and caused by COVID and found that 80% of the cases happened during the Omicron variant spike. Evidence suggesting that that variant is more likely to infect the upper airway than other variants, and that led to the spike. And only 12% of children from the study ended up hospitalized, and under half of those patients were actually admitted to the ICU.